Good day fellas, I hope you are ready for your daily dose of skill and today we are going to play with Škoda T40. You requested this vehicle so we are going to present this to you. Um, all and all it is quite interesting tank. Um, tier 6 obviously vehicle looks somehow like a... I don't even know can we call this tank Panzer but it looks somehow similar um, to that vehicle at least from the shapes, right? Um, alpha damage, 220 alpha damage, 140, um, 5 millimeters of penetration and a bit shy of the, um, 800 shell velocity, so 773. And with a gold, we have way lower shell velocity, which is, in my opinion, a very, very bad thing because to have slow shell velocity is no bueno. But at least we are having 200 millimeters of penetration and 200 millimeters of penetration is into the higher side speaking uh, um, and talking about the tier 6 vehicles. Obviously not tank destroyers because tank destroyers are way, way, way above that if we can say so. Okay, so this is our start. Um, we punished enemy light tank for 200 in the face. That's very beautiful and that's very nice. And at the same time, this is only the start. Bam, another punishment, 200 in the face. Uh, that's very good. Um, for a very first matchmaking, we are having Overlord and we are playing against the um, tier 7, tier 5, right? So we are pretty much mid tier here. And it is very, very good, fellas. It is extremely good matchmaking for us. Now, um, in order to abuse this position where we are playing, I would highly recommend you to have, um, to knock those trees down to this side. Why so? Because knocking those trees down are going to give you a very great flexibility um, and you are not going to get outspotted by people who are playing here. And that's very important thing to say, fellas. Meanwhile, let's take our time. And let's wait until enemies will mess up. I don't see the point why would I be super aggressive with this tank. And once again, this tank, fellas, is not created for aggression. Um, this vehicle do not have any armor whatsoever. And if you are thinking, oh, I am going to make a pressure in front and the tier 6 won't penetrate me. No, 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 no. This is not the tank for that, fellas. Trust me on this one. This is not the tank for that. Mm-hmm. Do I want to be involved? Mm -mm. We are losing the game. I know it doesn't look like it, but we are definitely losing the game. Our positions, although our positions are a bit better than enemies. Skill, why are you saying so? Well, you see, there is a, there is a very important thing I need to highlight. Um, we are having upper ground, so this is very, very good. Okay, now let's get involved into this situation. Let's go. We are going in. Oi, oi. Oi, oi. You naughty. Naughty boy. You naughty boy. Okay, Roger that. M6 was sitting here. I did not expect that. Um, and once again, that's my fault and that's my mistake. I should have expected that. Um, and at this point, we are thinking how to flank them properly and how not to get punished. As you can see, this guy is saying, I do not give a flying F. I'm going to deal with you and I'm saying not today. <laughs> Both of us missed, fellas. Both of us missed. Ay, 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 ay. Okay, so gun handling wise, this vehicle never ever was the best and it will never be the best. Um, this is very important thing to highlight and a funny thing is this tier 6 premium is not even close for a goodness of the tier 6 Skoda standard tech 3 tank, right? Um, tier 6 Skoda is like the top notch tank and this one is a bit different. Even though alpha damage of this vehicle is not that bad. All and all, do I think this tank is horrible? Nah, no, not really. I think this vehicle is playable, especially when the gun is treating you well. It is maybe even better than playable. Um, but uh, taking into the consideration, fellas, um, the gun handling can be annoying and gun handling can say... Pfft. 
Yeah, we cannot raid this tank good. It is just simply impossible, fellas. It is impossible to raid this vehicle good. Beautiful blind shot. I'm very happy with this. And here you go. That's what we have. Now, fellas, I believe we can finish everything only in one way. By jumping on the cover too. I think jumping on the cover 2 is going to be the best uh, and the most entertaining decision in this battle. What do you think? Meanwhile, where he is? Cover 2. Hop, hop, hop! Boom! I'm a very simple person. I said that many, many times. I have some addictions, okay? And jumping is one of those. Anyways, let's teleport to the scoreboard. And I must admit, fellas, I'm feeling so much better after that jump. So, what do we have? We have a first class. We have a high caliber. We have 2.7 thousand damage. 3 kills, 50 assisting damage. Pretty good game all and all. Um, we finish a top by experience. We finish a top by the damage. And we made 126 thousand profits although uh, quite some of the profits uh, came from the mission as well right uh, all and all i would say it was pretty solid game and i think we made this vehicle work uh let's keep it up let's go and we are back and matchmaking is not looking that great as before. Um, we are literally bottom tier here but once again it is completely understandable I cannot complain that much um, and uh, it is all right. So what do we want to do? We want to start our journey from the typical position here. I am starting the game usually from this position just because you can actually get a couple of the free shots from the crossing forces here. And now we need to be patient and we need to wait. That's one free shot beautiful uh, obviously this uh, this vaka is not feeling very happy about this but uh, i don't really think he can do anything about that and let's try to penetrate him like so unfortunately we are not capable of penetrate him uh, maybe we can do this this way uh, who will reload quicker? I think he might reload a bit quicker than I will, but it doesn't really change anything. Because first of all, he needs to hit us, and this is not going to be easy, fellas. Meanwhile, we spotted Mr. Churchill here in the back, so we are aiming for his uh, turret for obvious reasons, because Churchills um, have a very, very weak turrets. Uh, by the way, Blood Prince is not a Churchill, so do not aim for a Blood Prince uh, turret like this. Very nice. A great start. Uh, um, 800 damage, very, very good. And this is the main reason why you are taking this position, fellas. Because you can simply um, find enemies who are making one or another mistake and then you are just simply slaughtering them. And once again, this is important thing to say. If you never ever played with it from this position, even with whatever, IS-3 or anything else, um, try to do that. This can work very, very, very well. Mm. Greetings. I have a feeling this so wants to say uh, hello. Maybe he is, uh, maybe he is muted or something. Right? It could be possibility. So that's why how he is saying hello, skill. At least I would not act surprised if that would be the case. Meanwhile. What do we have? We have a gentleman who is making pressure through the middle. I do not really mind um, him that much, as wrong as it sounds. We are trying to penetrate him like this. It is very, very hard the angle to penetrate him. And now we have troubles. By saying we have troubles, we have Vaza, who is extremely, extremely aggressive. Uh, and um, he has opportunity to beat the living crap out of us. I want to see our Škoda helping for us, but I don't really think it is going to be the case. Oh, yes, it is the case. Oh, yes, it is the case. Bam into the cupola. Good, 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 good. Gahal! Oi. Oi, oi. Oi, oi. Oi, my heart, my heart, fellas, holy effing, if that was an angry guy. He went for it like there is no tomorrow. He did not give a single F, 
and he said, Skill, I will smack you so damn hard, you will forget your name. And uh, luckily, fellas, we had a friend who actually saved us, so I am pretty damn happy with all of this. Nice. Okay, we are sitting with a 2,000 damage already, and uh, Skill, what you can say at this point, patience. That's what we can say, fellas. Patience, this is only one thing what we can say. Also, I want to test something. Hmm. Patience. Bam. Beautiful shot. Let's see. Is this beautiful gentleman a baboon, fellas? Is he a baboon? Look at that PP raise it to the air. Look at that PP raise it. Beautiful. I have a feeling he uh, cannot type anything in the chat, it happens sometimes, right, when um, people are getting muted in the game, and that's probably the case, uh, uh, and this is the current situation for this gentleman. Either way, greetings uh, to you, buddy. Um, Alright, so, what we can do now, now we can get a bit more involved, I would say, and the first things first would be to eliminate this panzer beautiful or this vaka doesn't really matter and after that we need to get one more extra shot to charioteer or maybe nashgorn doesn't really matter nashgorn is trying to escape we are saying hello for him too bad we did not manage to penetrate him whoop miscuse 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 i want i want our suit to hit him sorry mate I did not meant to do that. I did not meant to block this guy. Sometimes it happens, right? Um, and all and all, considering we, we are bottom tier shitter in this game, I would rate this battle as a solid banana out of 10. Also, I was very, very lucky was I managed to miss the shot from the 10 meters distance, but what can I say? Unlucky gun made in China. What did you expect before buying this tank, right? Um, you could check out the skill for L2 index and you would see what this vehicle is all about, right? Easy peasy. Anyways, 2.1 thousand damage, 100 assisting damage. I'm feeling pretty good with our performance. We are first by experience. We are third by the damage. Um, and we have 35,000 profits in those four minutes. Not bad whatsoever. Let's go for a round nine number three let's go and we are back with around three and we have a tier six tier five matchmaking so we are top tier in airfield not the best map but i believe we can war uh, we can make it work also i have a question fellas what do you think about skoda t40 yourself right i believe quite some of you have this vehicle and what is your opinion about this tank do you think this vehicle is great or you think this vehicle is kind of kaku and by the way if someone still does not know what this tank is it is a tier 6 czechoslovakian medium premium tank right i think i mentioned i forgot to mention this um in the start of the video so i apologize for that okay so what do we have fellas what do we have First things first, we are opening um, our performance from the Juliet, um, from Ju uh, from the Juliet six. Um, why we are doing this? Because it works just fine, right? Uh, this is the first thing, and the second thing is we can have an extremely good angle to punish uh, tanks like Boogie or anyone else who are sitting here, right? Um, I went for two. I know it is kind of risky and I could take one for the team, but I decided to go for it, um, and everything is looking relatively well. At this point, I see the T1 here is trying to get a bit involved here, so what am I doing? I am thinking um, about punishing enemy Vaka who might might try to peek like this. I am pretty sure enemy Vaka might try to peek like this in any time. Mm -hmm. Boogie is getting involved and Buggy spotted us. Good. Okay, let's focus on first side or um, on one side I suppose to say to clear. So let's try to be the living crap out of the Boogie and T-34. That's the plan, that's the hope, that's the dream. Now. If the things will go well, and I believe things will go well, this boogie is dead. Beautiful. Um, this T-34 85M, I do not really think he is going to be so that aggressive, okay? I really doubt it. But what I think, I think we can have an angle to, um, to T-67. And I would say we could drop down like this. Ooh. Oy, that was quite silly. Oy, 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 how silly that was. Mm, my mistake. 
Nothing what I can change about this, fellas. That was my stupidity. I thought I am going to drop down without losing a single health, but I lost shit ton of the hit points. In fact, I lost one third of HP just because I was a silly goose. Um, once again, it is understandable. It happens even for the best. And now I know I cannot drop down that easily there, right? So it's not that horrible. At least we have information now. Meanwhile... Mr. Arl44, can we smack this guy in the face? And uh, I don't need to smack him in the face. I can smack him in the ass. Beautiful. Very, very nice. Um, extra free shot. Good. That's exactly what we want to see, right? This is exactly what we want to see, fellas. And once again, we are going to take our time to play in this position. We are not going to rush whatsoever. Now we should be able to kill this gentleman if I would not suck at aiming. Uh, that's on me. My bad decision, fellas. My bad. Okay. Let's return to the same position where we played before. And now if the things will go well, we should be able to eliminate the T-67 and obviously this cover one as well, right? So let's see. T-67 is dead. I do not like how do I play this game, fellas. I do not like what I am doing. My brain looks like my brain is saying um, and refusing to work at this point. Uh, and that's on me. Relax, skill, take it easy, give yourself a moment to uh, stand on your feet, okay? Skill, chill, I said. Beautiful. Sometimes you need to have a conversation with a smart person. Right? So, um... I'm not entirely sure how to approach the enemies here. I truly do not know. I made many bad decisions already. Mm, and I am a bit disappointed how did I play this game. But in the same time, I believe we should be able to find a very nice angle to uh, smack this Jackson from here. At least that's what I want to believe, right? So we are sitting in this position and we are just waiting until Mr. Jackson will say, yep. It is about the time to get involved with it. And whenever he is going to do so, we should be able to hit him once or twice. I see where majority of the enemies are. They are playing here. But the thing is, the gun depression of this vehicle is not uh, ideal. So, um, by any means, I do not want to get involved to that level where I need to play um, and use like minus 15 degrees of the gun depression. It is just simply not worth it, you know. If I would play with STB and I would play with what whatever, against E62A or E50, then we can work them out. But now, um, I need to be a bit smarter and I need to do the things better. Speaking about doing things better, we was patiently waiting until someone will get into our trap like a spider, knight and the leopard. By the looks of it, he is not a cat, fellas. Uh, he's a fly. So, yeah, beautiful. Very nice punishment for this gentleman, that's good. And I am waiting in the same position once again. Maybe his brother is going to do the same mistake and he is going to peek like this. And if he would do so, we are obviously smacking him. This is the weakest game so far speaking about our performance, right? Um, I think in this game I completely misplayed and I deserved what I got. And in the same time, I do not really think I can complain about being a silly goose myself. I simply messed up. I lost um, some hit points unnecessary and at this point I simply cannot be too aggressive. Although we are going to be fine and we will try to find a decent angle. Speaking about the decent angle, we are taking... Taking our time to hit the tier 5 uh, um, Vaka. Beautiful. I am peeking once again and I am hoping to hit him once again. Beautiful. I think this could be a hit and this should be a hit. And at this point I am... Uh, all I need to do, I need to get involved and I need to start banging this cover 1 or T3485, right? That's what we need to do. Beautiful. Um, okay, cover one, just like this, let's try to get involved, he is trying to make pressure, he is taking one for the team, I'm trying to be safe from the cuck, cover one is ignoring us, and he is going straight to the garage, nice, in the end of the day, fellas, we made it work, and once again, whenever I am 
saying bad things about the tank, I just simply make it work. I do not know how it works, but it definitely went this way. Uh, because, let's get real, I shit talk this vehicle quite a bit and I said it is not the best tank. And funny fact, I played with this tank better than um, the same Vaka, which I rated higher than this vehicle. So, yeah. Uh, can you do something about this skill? To be fair with you, not really. Um, I think it... It depends on the attitude as well, right? Um, when I think the tank is very, very good, sometimes I am simply over uh, making a hardcore pressure, right? And it is just simply not uh, paying off, unfortunately. Um, anyways. It is alright, we have a decent game here, I am very very happy with my decisions um, overall speaking about the whole session and if I need to guess our average performance I think it's going to be approximately 2.3, 2.4 average damage and like non assisting damage if I'm not mistaken, but let's see. Um, so. Uh, what we managed to get in this game, 1.7 thousand damage, 200 assisting damage, couple of kills, which is always nice, always welcome. First by the damage, first by experience, when we have 46,000 profits and all and all with this tank we have 2.2 thousand damage and 100 assisting damage. So to be fair with you, I wasn't uh, far away, uh, 2.3 thousand combined, right? So yeah, here you go, this is the Škoda. Once again, fellas, I would highly recommend to use the index page if you care about uh, expectation values to get mark of excellence which are 1.8 thousand when I am recording the video. Um, if you care how much experience you need to get ace, uh, if you care about the crew setup, how to start cruise and how to uh, keep it up and how to keep going right uh, and in the same time boys and girls ladies and gentlemen field modifications are there as well so keep this in mind. So. Thank you very much for watching fellas, I hope you had a great time and I hope you enjoyed yourself and see you very very soon, skill is done for today, peace.